Peace and love. This is Charlotte's son. I am the host of The Journey Begins, your story, your purpose. Today, I want to talk about how you cancel out spots when you're going to bed, right before you go to bed. It is imperative that you do certain things so you can be able to go to bed at night with a clean, as I say, a clean slate. So the first thing that I wanted to talk about is have a self-care journal. A self-care journal is the best thing that you can have because you can write your thoughts down of what what went on that day. Um, Make sure everything isn't negative. So make sure when you do write, write down the things that happen but write down more so the positive things that you did in that day so i'm going to give you a couple examples in this journal and uh in here it says taking care of others so how can i lift up others how can i make someone feel loved today uh how can i inspire others Also, there's a daily checklist, a nightly checklist. You can do that. Um, Then there's, you know, I really like this, is the describe something I love about me. What do I need to let go of right now? And that's the important thing. What do you have to let go? Also, What are the most beautiful parts of me? So make sure that you get a self-care journal. The second thing is, do not watch anything on television that is negative. I don't care news, um, any type of movies, any type like action films that have anything that has violence in it, or just anything that's negative, don't watch it because if you watch it right before you're going to bed, you're not going to wake up in a, in a, in a great mood. So don't, don't do that. Do not, do not watch it because it, it just, it will mess up your whole, um, conscious consciousness. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't watch anything negative. Another thing is do not Accept any phone calls, one that's going to call you and disturb you before you go to bed because they're going to talk to you and tell you their problems and it's going to, it's going to be on you. Um, and you can't, you won't be able to sleep at night. You're all stirred up because you didn't heard all this negative, uh, propaganda. So don't do it. Another tip is breathe meditate and pray breathe meditate and pray those are all in one you should be able to take do breathing exercises you know breathe and just think of some good things that you want to do ahead of time or just think about what you know, some, some something beautiful. Think about some something beautiful. Uh, what is to come? You know, but definitely uh, breathing, med or meditating or prayer. Well, obviously prayer because we gonna pray to the the Creator because at the end of the day, He got us through the day. So pray to the Creator. Pray to God ask God to direct you in the steps and and be able, like we say, pray and make sure that you get up in the morning because that's who you need to pray as far as that. That's who I pray to, you know, so I pray to God at night before I go to bed of how thankful and grateful I am for the things that he has allowed me to do in that day so that being said i love you peace
peace and love. And make sure you subscribe to the IBP Media Group channel and hit the notification bell. I'm Charlotte and have a good night.